After a drive through in San Juan was robbed by four teenagers, police recommend local business owners have a plan of action. CBS's Joel Flores explains what preventative measures that they're taking. Surveillance video released to CBS4 shows one of four teens who walked into a drive through on South Nebraska Tuesday night and attempted to rob it. You can see the clerk attempting to protect herself by grabbing a gun, but that same teen grabs it from her and fires it as he runs out. This was a planned robbery. They planned to do it. San Juan Police Chief Juan Gonzalez tells CBS4 the teens, all 16-year-old males, first stole a 14-year-old cell phone and then shortly after set their sights on the drive through We had an individual that planned it. You had a vehicle, a private vehicle. You had another individual that had a toy gun that they were using to do the robberies. In this case, it just turned really violent at, at the second robbery when the business owner or tenant that was there decided that she had a right to defend herself and uh, you know, we agree with it. Chief Gonzalez says these teens already have a criminal record, including possession of marijuana. All four teens have confessed to the crimes and faced charges of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and aggravated robbery. We have a, our share of uh, violent crimes involving teens. Most crimes involve teens. The staff here at Rolos Number 3 drive through tell us the robbery caught them completely off guard. That's why law enforcement say it's important to have a plan of action. Either you have a panic button, you have video surveillance, you have something that, to protect yourself, or you have, uh, you don't work in by yourself. Well, nada más el método que tenemos es para el, el, del botón del arma. Meme's drive through in San Juan has served over 100 customers a day for nearly 20 years. Maria del Carmen Garza Borrego has worked there for seven years and says she does fear the same could happen to her. That's why they stay extra vigilant, paying close attention to their surroundings. In San Juan, Joel Flores, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. Now, Chief Gonzalez added that his department also offers free weapon retention training to local business owners at their request.